Well, the pandemic's still going on. <sighs> Might as well do another season. A few months ago, 20 Survivor fans from all across the globe came together, but not on an island. Virtually, done over Zoom, Snapchat, Instagram, any which way they could contact each other. And now, 20 new castaways, again, from all around the globe, have come together to battle it out. Why? Not for money, but just to prove they are the best of the best. This is Virtual Survivor Season 2. There will be blindsides, betrayals, and even heartwarming love stories. All together, right now. 39 days, 20 people. One virtual survivor. Yes, I all you good. guys could just kind of be quiet for like a couple minutes or so. I'd like first of all to welcome you guys to Virtual Survivor Season Two. We tried our hardest to gather up the best of the best for who applied. We got a lot of applications. It was honestly really hard to choose from. You all, you guys made the cut. Right. And, and uh, uh an email to, like, I got an email a few days ago from Michael, like, oh, um, hey, you still interested in uh, joining second season? I was like, heck yeah! yeah I had there you, there I we go. Michael, I had to give Michael yeah. my Instagram this morning. <laughs> yeah. All right. So, uh, I think we'll just go down the line, uh, like season one, I guess. Uh, we'll just ask for introductions from everyone. We'll ask what's what your name, how old you are, where you're from and why you think you can do well in this season. So we will start with Hudson. Oh, oh okay. Um, <laughs> no so pressure. I'm, I'm Hudson. Um, I'm 15 years old. Um, I'm from Tampa, Florida. I play baseball. Um, and yeah, I'm just here to have fun. I like Survivor, so I think this will be a fun thing to do. Solid. All right, Seb. Oh, hello. All right, anyway, yeah, I'm Seb Shepherdson from Newcastle, England. I'm 18. Yeah, it's my birthday. I the day of the fucking casting, so yeah. Um, I'm, yeah, I'm a psychology student at the moment. Well, I'm not a uni yet, but that's life. And yeah, I think I could do all right. You can't underestimate the Brits. We watch Survivor. But yeah, I'm just here to have a good time, meet some cool people. Good all luck. right, solid, solid. All right, next up, Raul. Oh, Hello, I think... Oh. Um, my name is Raul Egbert. I'm years old. I live in... California, Palm Beach, California. Um, right now I'm a high school student. Uh, we'll move next to uh, Michaela. Hi, I'm Michaela. Um, I live in Vermont, uh, USA. Um, I'm 21, and I'm a huge Chicago Fire fan. Of, and this is Ellie Bingham fan as well. I <laughs> just so happen to be wearing the shirt. Okay, next up, uh, Logan. Oh, all right. I guess, <clears throat> I guess that's me. So I'm Logan. I'm 18 from Washington State, and I mean, I'm just happy to be here. I, I didn't really expect to get in, so I'm just happy to be here. What can I say? <laughs> Don't think very, I have this. very respectful, honestly. All right. Next up, Nick. Hey, everyone. I am Nick Pellegrino. I'm from in, in the United States of America. I'm 20. Uh, Rebecca, thanks for the whatever that was. Uh, I am I am currently a counselor for at-risk kids whose parents are essential workers, and I'm studying to be a special education teacher. And I'm excited to be here. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, next up, Rebecca. Hi, I'm Rebecca, and I, uh, I'm from UK. Yeah, represent. Woo! Gang shit. Gang uh, shit. I'm 16. Um, and I think I might be the only girl here. No, uh, okay. No, we have another. Yeah! <laughs> nice, two girls, yeah! Alright, so we'll move on to Jonah. What's up, I'm Jonah. I'm 16 years old. I'm from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. I'm a high school student. And, um, I play hockey. And I'm excited to play with you. Solid. All right, moving on, uh, we got Andrew. Yo, what's up? I'm Andy. I'm 18. I'm an accounting student at St. Joseph's University. 
um, and I'm originally from a town about half an hour outside of Boston. So basically, I'm a trashy Boston rog without the accent. <laughs> I don't that is very <laughs> interesting. That is a very <laughs> bold statement. <laughs> All right. Be the amber of the season then. Okay. Next up, we have Tyler. I'm Tyler. I'm 18 years old from Pennsylvania, and um, I'm excited to be here. And um, I'm going to college to uh, play American football. To uh, Devin. All right. What's up? What's up? My name is Devin. Um, I'm from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Here. And um, what else are we supposed to? Oh, sorry. I'm 16. Um, I am a student slash recording artist. I make music. Um, and yeah. We will go to Scott. Uh, hi. I'm Scott. I'm from Illinois. And I've watched a few seasons of Survivor. And um, yeah, I don't really know what my strategy is going to be. I just want to have fun. That's fair. That's fair. It's always good to have fun. All right, next up we got Victor. Hey guys, I'm Victor. I'm 17. I live in Oklahoma. Big Survivor fan. So, yeah. Gang Solid. Shit. All right. Solid. Okay, next up we have uh, Goody. Uh, hello. I'm Goody. I turn 14 tomorrow. Uh, I'm in the eighth grade, and I'm very excited to play Survivor. Jo Josh, is have you fixed your audio? Yeah, apologies. <laughs> no worries, no worries. We can hear okay. you now, so it's good. Uh, my name is Josh HW. I prefer HW. Um, I'm 17. I'm from Long Island, New York. I'm a big Survivor and a big Ravens oh, okay. fan, and I'm ready to meet some new friends, meet some new people, and uh, get going. Okay. Uh, Sierra, I don't know if you got your audio fixed yeah, as well. I, can you hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Uh, okay. Uh, I'm Sierra. Uh, I live in the Netherlands. I do track and field, and I'm interested in survivor and i just want to have some fun awesome awesome is my mic working yes yeah your mic is working okay. okay hi my name is kaz harada i'm from hawaii i'm 12 years old and i came here to win the game oh wow came here for one purpose okay <laughs> first of all we're not going to do anything like the first season if you guys watched it uh, we're not gonna do any random generator stuff. Uh, we're gonna make it, we're just ra we randomize it as it is. So we have Kabe, which is yellow. It means sunrise in Fijian. Uh, we have Jonah, Logan, Goody, Kaz, Seb, Rebecca, James, H.W., Raul, and Aiden. Aiden actually isn't here yet. I think I don't know if Aiden can make it or not. Uh, but he's also on your, tri on your tribe. So you guys will all be in uh, email chains for everything, ranging from idle clues to information about the game. And yeah, so same thing goes for Dromu, which is the other tribe. That means sunset in Fijian. Uh, you guys are, your guys' color is dark blue. I should have also mentioned that Kabe's color is yellow. Um, and Dromu consists of Devin, Hudson, Jesse, Michaela, Scott, Tyler, Victor, Sierd, Nikki, and Andy. What's up? It's Jonah here. Do you remember me from the play-in? Season one? Maybe? <laughs> well, here I am, and Raul was also from the plan of season one. And I was very close to getting on season one. Obviously, I was an alternate, so it was Raul. And we didn't quite get our shot that time, but now we're getting our chance this time. I'm so excited to be back, really. I mean, I, I'm technically back. I was on season one there for one episode, didn't quite get in. This time, I did get in. Let's go. So, I'm really excited. I'm really excited to get the show on the road. I am 16 years old. I am from Montreal, Quebec. Canada. I'm a high school student. I played hockey. Obviously because of COVID, you know, that's the, I don't play it right now. But, you know, I did play hockey um, at some point. I think it's, it's a bit stressful because we weren't allowed to pre-game at all. This is the first time I met anybody here. That's... Uh, abuse! 
at all, at all. Look at this, look at this, look at this woman. I mean, it is true though that in our season that we were allowed to. Yeah, you're allowed. So you had in your mind, you know, Connor was always going to go mm. home. We don't know anybody here, so whoever goes out is based on the most minute mistake. And I'm. F you, 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 you are scrambling, right? We, we're scrambling, scrambling, scrambling. Like, texting people left, right, and centre. We can't text people because we have their numbers yet. Uh, we have text on the stupid Zoom chat thing. It's so dumb. Mm. Yeah. Well, I must say though, I was the person who told you, yeah, reach out to my boy Jonah because Jonah's my boy from season one. He was my fan, so I got you. So hopefully that works out. Oh yeah, but we're, uh, oh yeah. Side thing, I'm not telling anyone you're my brother because at this point, because it's just too much, you know. I mean, they're gonna find out because you're you're not gonna lie, you're kind of dumb. So you're you're probably gonna make them find out. You're dumb, right? You'll probably text them. So how is everything going in forms of alliances? You know, I think to myself that every day, and I believe I'm in a very good position. You have Seb, Jonah, Rebecca, Rawl, and myself, and of course, Five Alliance. I think it's too early to make a move in this game, including where I sit at, and that will put a huge target on my back. And I don't want that yet. My strategy going into this game, I feel like I should be able to get a lot of good vibes with my tribe, build social bonds, and once I get to either a tribe swap or a merge, that's when I need to start playing the game. Try to look for idols, try to win challenges, further myself through the game, and hopefully I can be able to win this in the second season. Scott and Hudson um, are both kind of kind of respectable players. Um, had the chance to talk with them, and um, it seems like the three of us are going to make kind of a core tight three alliance. Um, and uh, we can always bring people in whenever we need them. But between me, Scott, and Hudson. I think the three of us are going to stay pretty tight throughout this whole game, and um, hopefully we can take that and um, kind of build around it, and um, see where we go from there. So, that's kind of where we're at. So, Hudson is my number one from the get-go. He's like the first person I talk to, because, you know, of course. But anyway, so aside from Hudson, there's five other people who um, have Snapchat, and that's Victor, Andy, Sierd, I think that's how you pronounce his name, I think it's Sierd. Um, Nick and Devin. So me and Hudson, those five, we all form an alliance called the Snapchat Alliance. And it was originally intended to be a tribe chat, but like there's only some people who have Snapchat, so let's just make an alliance. So that's kind of the main alliance out of the get-go, and it hasn't really been challenged so far. Thank the Lord, because otherwise I would I would be panicking. This one I really start talking to Tyler a lot. And Tyler, if you didn't know, he and Michaela and Jesse are the people that are already on the outs because they don't have Snapchat. And so Tyler and I begin talking. Tyler wants to form an Instagram alliance, and he basically um, he wants me and Hudson, and then he also wants Victor and um, Victor, Andy, and Sierra. Yeah, I think that's it. So we form an Instagram alliance, and um, he's like he wants me and Hudson to be his type trio, but me and Hudson were like, you know, this is we want to stick with Snapchat, so. We're just humoring Tyler right away, and we're kind of like, and we, we, we inform everyone else that we're just humoring, humoring him too, but like, let's just keep this Instagram thing as a second option, just in case his Snapchat thing fails. At the moment, there have been seven people that have given out their Snapchat, and are pretty much talking on Snapchat, nobody really uses emails, but that's weird. Um, but the seven people on Snapchat right now are me, Andy, Devin, Scott, Nick, Sierra, I think that's how you say his name, Sierra, and Victor. And us seven, we've all pretty much talked amongst each other on Snapchat, and right now there's a group chat actually with us seven in it, and I'm not, I, I wouldn't say that's a tribal group chat, I think right now what the plan is, is for us seven to stick together, that's what I've heard, is that Andy is throwing out the idea of us seven, let's just stick together and make a big Snapchat alliance, and I don't have a problem with that, because that protects me, and 
I'm, I don't want to cause, I don't want to go against the grain this early on. So it's your boy Seared reporting live from the Netherlands. So I want to tell you a little, a little bit about the alliances going on in the Dromu tribe. So right now there's a core alliance of seven people, including me, Scott, Victor, Andy, Hudson, Nick, and Devin. I think that's all of them. Uh, so that's a great alliance. It it will probably last me till uh, the tribe swap at least. I found something interesting about one of the people on the Kabe tribe. Uh, the girl Rebecca, her surname is Foster. You know whose surname is also Foster? That's right, Marco Foster, the runner-up from season one. And if you watch season one, you know that Marco is a very sneaky and mischievous player. He's my favorite player of the of the last season, but he's still very dangerous. And if his sister is anything like that, that's pretty scary. But like then again, I would want to align with Marco, so maybe I want to align with Rebecca too. But I think it's just pretty interesting that I that she's on the cast. So the the biggest threats in my opinion in uh, the tribes right now are Devin and Andy. Uh, Devin is just an incredible social player. You talk to him, he immediately gets on your good side, he gets on everyone's good side, and that scares me, you know. If you combine social play with strategy, that's like the most dangerous combination you can have. And I don't really want to go with him in the merge. I think he can easily flip or flip people to our alliance, but I'm not willing to take that risk, you know. But since he is in our main alliance, I would rather see someone on the out go like Tyler, Michaela, or Jesse than him right now. But I'm definitely on my toes for Devon. Hi, my name is Cass Harada. I'm from Hawaii. I'm 12 years old and I came here to win the game. So, when we introduce each other, um, this guy named Scott H, aka Cass, we're acting, we're acting highly about himself, thinking that he can win the game. My only strategy, he already got his target on his back, but at the same time, Giddy, I had some uneven, uneven advice for him, that's what the vibes I came from. So those two, right now, are my targets, at this point, but I don't know who's trying to target right now. So, you guys want to get into your first challenge? Yeah. 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 <laughs> awesome. Yeah. Awesome. So, yeah. so yeah. for yeah. the first Thank challenge you. on Virtual Survivor Season Two. So I believe Jerome was going first. So if okay. you guys want to pick the way. We have a lot of options. Oh. So really, I think we go first. It doesn't, I don't think there's any negative levity either. Yeah. I would it's say like, the fourth cup on the first row, maybe. The okay. fourth cup on the first row. That. So you guys want to pick that one? Yeah. Yeah. So he's picking it now. And no dice. Right, so right. that is no point for Dromu. We will switch it over to Kabe. So right, yeah. anyone from Kabe wants to strategize? I mean, there isn't really strategizing. I feel you guys like, want to go with that? I, wait, I feel like he would try to hide it in places in cups he wouldn't think us to pick. So I like... That's true, that's true right there. So like, like, second from the corner, like... Or like second from the left bottom corner. Okay. So reveal. Come on. No ah. dice. No dice, unfortunately. Wow. One. So listen closely. This is the clue. So one of the gray Lego pieces is on either the far left or far right side. So there's your clue. So maybe we just do the corners in the far right. Fine, no, okay. I would say okay. maybe it's like not necessarily smart to pick on the left or the right side because there's only one in both. Yeah, both exactly. I, I agree with that because it's like it's more problem. If the other, so there, four, other there's like, a bigger chance. There are four. There are four rocks in the middle three uh, rows of cups. So that one. 
like, I feel like that might be a good one. Alright, so he's right. revealing. Oh, and uh, no cigar, unfortunately. Okay. No cigar, unfortunately, so we're going back to Kabe. So far, I've no points. Thinking. One from the top, we go one down from the top. One right. from the top, right? Yeah, that looks good. Yeah, that yeah. good. Alright, so you guys want to go with that? So, yeah. yeah. Eld, if you can reveal. Come on, baby. No <laughs> dice. Really? No Come dice. On. So, Next still no move. points, unfortunately, for you guys. So, we will keep moving on. Dromu, you're up. My okay, God. so Come on. there is only two rocks in the top and bottom rows total. So, okay. for, for, so for a bit of confusion, the top row, there's one rock, and there's another rock in the bottom. Okay, oh, I now I think bottom, we have middle. to go the middle top, yeah. the middle top on the bottom row. Oh, you don't have to go bottom row because there's already two yeah. out there. Do you guys want to choose the bottom left corner? Yeah. 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 No okay. Elt will reveal. That doesn't have one. I bet it's in the middle. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So that is a that point. Let's go. So we have one point for Dromu, first to three wins, so we will move back to Kabe. <laughs> you know what I'm thinking, but I'm feeling? What are you thinking? The man? top right, but the second one. Like, yeah. all the way on the right, but the second one, like, yeah. from the middle. Yeah, that one. I'm feeling good about yeah. that. That sounds good, yeah. I like that one. Let's try. So the top right, second from the middle. Yeah. Good. That is nothing. So we're, still, so we're still 1-0 for Dromu. Uh, so we know that it's another 1-3 and three shot on the top. Yeah. I believe there is yeah, the that. last clue now. Wait. There is at least one rock in each horizontal row, but only one row has two. Like what? So uh, horizontally, okay. so horizontally okay. there is one rock, okay. but, one rock has, but one of them has two. Okay, so that means that there's... There's one on the top row and only one on the bottom row, right? Because we know there's there's one on the yeah. there's two on the top and bottom, and there can't be two think, uh, bottom because that would be no. So guys, that's since we all since we all already had the one on the left side, that means that it can be on the left or on the right side again. So it's that's the that, that middle one. Be, now, uh, so let's go for the middle. Yeah. What about yeah. the second row? Because we haven't had any from there yet. We only have four yeah. choices. Okay. Yeah, I think it's not. So he Eld is gonna reveal. Oh, and yeah. unfortunately it is no point. So we will move back. It's right. still one nothing. Somehow. Right. Okay. <laughs> so I mean Okay. So it looks like we have a decision. Okay, Eld. Hefty mod, can you reveal? Empty of this. Yes. Okay. And that is a okay. point yes, for Kabe. Yes. Oh my god. So now we are one yes. all. We okay. Are one more. <laughs> There's no more on the top and bottom. Yeah. You yeah. got the one from the bottom left. There's no more on the top or bottom. I, I think it's fourth column, third row. So scared, scared makes a decision. I think we should go. I think we should do that middle one that um, we were going to do earlier and then chose not to do. There's only five left and four of them are under there, so we have to get one this time. It's not, I don't think it's on the bottom row, though. But it's not, not the bottom row. It's not on the bottom. With that one, yeah. can you please reveal? Hello! Unfortunately, somehow, it is still 1-1. One, one. Uh, only two rocks uh, have been picked. This is Right, this is my logic. Since they went for that one, should we go for the one above it? Right, yeah. Yeah. Either that or the one next to it. For this cup, God. reveal please. Oh. Eight points. Oh. So we are still, somehow, 1-1. Okay. One, one. This is a three catastrophe, in the guys. Okay, be one three in the I have an idea. Third row from the bottom. So no, third, third row from above, the bottom. One above. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think that's it. Are we all, all agree? All agree? Yeah. Yeah, go. Yeah. So reveal please. Okay. Oh, yeah. uh, That's and good. there we go. That is finally, okay. finally, a point, and it is for Dromu. Okay, one Dromu more. has the advantage. So it's two one. one more. It is two one Dromu. It is first to three. So if Dromu gets Wait, one more, we get point, they have an immunity. So it's hope we could probably just go with the one below the one they just picked. I have a feeling that might. Yeah. Mm. Horizontal line. Hold up, hold up. So the top row has been. Top row had one. Did the bottom row have? Bo did the bottom row have one yet? Yeah, the bottom row yeah, had one. one. Yeah, we. Bottom, bottom left. Then we picked the one in there. 
So, you guys want to go with the one that Elf has his hand on? So, yeah. Elf, if you could please reveal. Come on, man. Oh! Okay. And that is a point for Kabe. Yeah. So it is sudden death. It's 2-2. Two, two. One no, it's not, not, one not, of the big wait, ones. Listen, one wait, two. listen to Nick. Nick is saying that. something. Wait. Listen to Nick. One horizontal row has two. None of No horizontal row has had two chosen yet. The one above the middle bottom is the only one that's an option. Okay, yeah. so you guys want to go with the one yeah. that Eld has his hand on. Yeah. Yes. I'm fine. Eld, if you could please reveal. <laughs> Let's go! go. And that oh is it! Oh my gosh! True move. Thank you, Nick. Wins immunity. Thank you, Nick. Oh, Sending oh, Kame there. to Tribal Council. Yes. Whoever is on Dromu, so that's Devin, Hudson, Jesse, Michaela, Scott, Tyler, Victor, Sierra, Nick, and Andy. You guys will have to leave the call, but you guys have one immunity, so Everyone you guys don't get to vote someone out tonight. Alright, see ya. Good luck, guys. Good luck, Yellow. Good luck, Rebecca. Alright, guys. Good luck, guys. Good luck, guys. The challenge today was fun. Um, I'm very relieved to be safe because I honestly expected to be the first boot, knowing my luck. But I guess I'm good for another couple days, so that's sick. But um, I wasn't as worried about the challenge part as I was kind of feeling out my tribe mates. There's a lot of talkers in there, a lot of people that like getting their voice heard, which is exactly how I expected it to be. But um, yeah, so I had to stay quiet, just kind of felt everyone out a little bit. But also another thing that does intimidate me is that there's already talks of a majority alliance and my goal is to solidify myself into that majority just to guarantee my safety when eventually we do lose immunity so that would be ideal and um i guess my main goal from here on out is to figure out who the power players are in my tribe so i can align with them and then when the time comes i cut their heads off and if that sounds cruel well it's a cruel game so that sucks So during the challenge, I made two alliance members in James and Sub. Sub so now three, but after the challenge, Jonah, you know, from the playing realm, which I also can say, Outcast Alliance, Outcast Alliance. Well, of course, I agree with him. We go for Outcast in season one, and I decided to target. But also, I decided to target Cas in case he's got eight. And I told Sub, James, and Jonah to target Scotty. Okay, so I can't Cass. Well, in that case, Scott H, Cass, whoever you prefer. Sorry, buddy, but you're going home tonight by me. I'm not exactly sure where I'm at right now. It's kind of to say because you know we didn't really get enough time to connect and i still haven't messaged anyone like i don't know what to email them or like try and get zoom or something i'm probably gonna have to like email people and kind of get connections that way because otherwise i'm gonna be on the outs really quick uh and like i said it's an easy start it's really marco 2.0 i mean i guess it's a bit early to call that but come on i mean you you look at this man British, loud and boisterous, swears a lot more than literally anyone else has, took control of the votes early. It, it, I don't know. I think we're in for Marco 2.0, but he seems a bit, I don't know if he's a better player though, because he's not being solid. He's going to get blasted early. I have a feeling he's going to get blasted early. Rebecca is interesting, because I'm 90% sure that's Marco's sister. I'm 90% sure. I mean, one, she's British. Two, she looks like the sister featured in Marco's video. Three, her last name is Foster. It's like, c come on. Uh, who else? There wasn't a ton of interesting people, I'll be honest. Uh, HW is pretty chill. I guess we'll have to see. Um, I really think I just need to start talking to people. <laughs> Might try to do my next confession in a better spot with more lighting, so... I don't know. We'll see for now. Rebecca is my main ally, along with James. Because we got the Apple Gang, which is me, 
James, Raul, Jonah, Rebecca. Strong five right there. And you know what? We're gonna have two British winners in a row. But this time, it ain't gonna be a girl. It's gonna be your boy, sir. I'm winning this game, dude. And we're gonna hopefully find some advantage or an idol. Let's just see how everything goes today. So we lose the immunity challenge. Literally a challenge based purely on luck and luck alone. Uh, this cup challenge, complete luck. I don't care what anybody says. Whatever, I'm bitter about it, but it's okay. So, I keep on hearing Kaz's name being floated around by everybody. I mean, Raul said it, Rebecca said it, Seb said it, James said it. And they, just, they you know, they want to get numbers so that they can then just pull in anybody. Once they have numbers, they can just let everybody know. And they're either sitting ducks or they just go along with the plan to vote Kaz. That seems to be what everyone's agenda is right now. But I'm thinking, like, why Kaz? Like, why would we get rid of Kaz? He literally, like, he was very vocal at the challenge. He helped us a lot. Apparently, Raul is threatened by him because he said at the meeting that he's 11 years old and he's here to win the game. Whatever. Aiden didn't even, he didn't even show up. So he's the weak link right now. So I don't know. I'm thinking Aiden for who to vote out. And I don't exactly know if there's time to, like, stir something up to change it, but I don't know. Cause doesn't even want Aiden out. He wants Seb gone, so I don't know. First real question, I guess. I mean, <laughs> Josh or HW. Still don't know what you go by. Uh, HW, please. Okay. Hey, man. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to host, man. Okay. No, you're good. You're good. So today's challenge was based on solely guessing, and both tribes really struggled with guessing. Do you think the struggling and challenges will continue going forward? Absolutely not. I have full confidence in this group. We have a bunch of smart people in this tribe, and. Um, Mark my words, we will be a powerhouse moving forward. I, I think that it's not a matter of getting rid of the weakest thing at this point. Well, yeah, I because think that yeah, the if, say, like, if the yeah. challenges are guessing, then it doesn't matter who guessed the right one. It's, just, it's literally guessing. Yeah, well, Kaz, I was gonna, I was gonna point out actually that there is, there you really can't point out a weakest link in your tribe because the challenge was solely based on guessing. Exactly. exactly. So you can't, so you can't really pin a weakest link. So Jonah, if any, of, if any of these guys haven't noticed you or Raul, you guys were actually in the play-ins for season one. Yeah. If any of you guys actually watched the season, so I did. But I kind of forgot what happened here. Do you think, do you think that, do you think that a possible play-in alliance could come into play going forward? Nope. No, I think you know, we're all we're all one unity. Uh, that's not that's not gonna be the case. No, I, we're I, all I, one big happy family. Yeah, I was only on that call for like it was only like, like an hour call. Um, I'm just really happy to be here. I mean, the first time yeah, you know, yeah, I, was, I was in one episode and then I didn't get. I was so close to getting on season one. And I'm really happy to be here. So. That's that's good to hear. We were we were really hoping. I mean, I have my habit big target on their back because since they almost got in in the last season, possibly we be targeted later on. Yeah, but here's the thing, we shouldn't, you shouldn't play into the fact that things from happen that before this game, but that's kind of the thing. That's like, to be fair, that's like saying you go to someone else that you don't like them before you met them in the game, that's just kind of stupid. Forgot to mention, there is actually, I would like to point out one person who isn't here on your tribe. His name is Aiden, so he is, he is oh, actually know. allowed to get votes tonight. Target, target! <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> no! You should let him have a chance. Yeah, I think we exclude him. Let's exclude from this trial. I'd feel bad. Yeah. yeah. I wouldn't even get That's it. fair, yeah. He doesn't even get a chance to prove himself, so was, why should we vote him? I'd feel like an absolute douche if I voted. And that really, then that really comes yeah. into play with someone not being here. Should, could you just vote him out? Because it's a potentially a really easy vote out for you guys. Or could it be a potential number going forward for an alliance? If we sealed him because he couldn't show up, then that's just... Exactly, that's just me. That's just me. That's just me. Yeah. That's me. So James. I'm still, I'm still adamant about him, Michael. <laughs> yeah, James, obviously. Like, obviously. James, yeah, obviously. Oh, Seb, I'm trying, oh, yeah. I'm trying to ask a question here. I'm trying to ask James over here a question. You're interrupting me. You're interrupted by time. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. So, James, obviously, this is the first vote. I mean, I, Jeff Pro says it in every season. Just not, just let it not be me. Just not the first, anything but the first yeah, vote. 
I, I really hope- are you just hoping it's not you at this point? At any point, I'm willing to work with anyone. As long as it's not me tonight, I'll be happy. And that's how I'm going for with, depending on how the votes go. Awesome. Okay, on that note, we will get to the vote. Seb, you're up. This all went, like, incredibly quickly. It went from challenge right to tribal council. We barely got any time to strategize, so... Well, I guess it gets it through quicker, I guess, so I can understand. Yeah. Okay, so... Like 20. Okay, Logan, you're up. You can send your vote. Alright. Okay, Raul, you're up. Okay, Rebecca, you're up. Okay. Is anyone... Goody, you're up. And... Jonah, you're up. Alright, James, you're up. Okay, there we go. And finally, Kaz, you're up. Awesome. Okay. I will go tally the votes. I'll read the votes. I'll read the votes. Oh, God. First vote. Kaz. Seb. That's one vote, Kaz. One vote, Seb. Kaz. Kaz. That's three votes, Kaz. One vote, Seb. Kaz. That's four votes, Kaz. One vote, Seb. Kaz. That's five votes, Kaz. One vote, Seb. And the first person voted out of Virtual Survivor Season 2, it's gonna be Kaz. You no, could bring fine. your, uh... No, your Kaz, I respect you for voting. I respect you for voting. I'm sorry, man. Good I'm game, sorry. bro. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. Good game. Okay. You vote me, Kaz, it's all good, man. GG, man. <laughs> yep, GG, so, man. Unfortunately, GG. Kaz, the uh, tribe, virtual tribe has I'm spoken. I'm doing this for something. My so, Kaz. Yeah. Alright, so, all right. unfortunately, Kaz, that is it. Unfortunately, it's time to go. Good luck, I hope y'all make it far. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, right, buddy. Kaz. Sorry. Please don't make it so one tribe member makes it to the merge. <laughs> We're not doing a play. No reference to my blood. That's the cursed tribe right there. We're gonna make her on. Do it. I feel very offended. Alright. Well, unfortunately, uh, everyone, well, you guys are. That's really it. I mean, you guys have decided as a tribe, you guys have wanted to vote out. And it seems that, judging by the vote, it, it seems you guys are very united as a tribe. So, grab all your torches, head back to camp, and good night. Grab, grab the virtual torch. Kaz, um, unfortunately, you still have been voted out of Virtual Survivor. However, we are giving you an advantage in this game. So you're gonna pick someone on your tribe who you would like to give a secret advantage to. So you're gonna say, would you like an advantage one or advantage two? Uh, advantage two. It's kinda hard considering that they all voted me. That is true. So you chose advantage two, and he's still choosing who he wants to give it to. I'm giving it to Aiden. We want to give it to Aiden. Oh, okay, okay. You know what? That's actually really smart. That's actually really smart. So you're giving an advantage to to Aiden. Mhm. Mm okay. Nice. Awesome. Okay. That's really it. Thanks for uh, coming back. I guess we were worried you'd be a little bit angry. You got voted out. So thanks, guys. You've been a real good sport. It was actually really fun having you, in all honesty. Like, you seemed like a really good kid, and we're actually really ashamed that you got voted out first. We were, we were rooting for you. You know, it sucks to be the first one to be voted out, because you're out of the game, you didn't get a chance to fight, and like, I was kind of hoping to make it to the merger. But like, you know, it's okay. I'm really happy that I got to experience this. This was fun, even though I only got to experience like 30, like 20, 30 minutes of it. And like another thing is like, it was pretty fun. Like my team, the teams were pretty helpful. The tribal 
the council, it felt like I was in the actual show. But yeah, 